there's only a small percentage of the world who get up and win by any means necessary. The rest of the world is trapped by the distractions that are placed upon them by the modern world. Sports, news, social media, school, university. The five pillars of modern life that rules modern society. In today's video, I will dissect a character named Ayano Koji Kiyotaka. After countless research I bring to you an elaborate plan to train like Ayano Koji. And holy shit for the people in the comments, before you type you can't be like anime characters or you shouldn't be emotionless etc etc. The purpose of this video is to use Ayano Koji as a vehicle to drive people to their best version of themselves by using his perfect traits and habits. But now you're gonna say well it's impossible and I smell very bad, it does not matter and having limited beliefs are just going to keep you down where you deserve to be. I'll be going over how to create Ayano Koji's environment, his diet plan, physical training method, mental training method, optimizing your dopamine system and mindset. If you're looking for one specific thing, feel free to skip ahead. I'll begin by explaining a system you guys should understand to become better individuals using Ayano Koji as an example. Straight 7 System This is a system only a few people know about, but it falls in perfectly for people who want to imitate Ayano Koji's greatness. What makes Ayano Koji so brilliant isn't a single attribute but a combination of everything, his intellect, his body, his fighting, his observation, etc. So we aren't aiming to be strongest or the smartest, but being a 7 out of 10 all round. I'm not saying that you can't be higher than 7 in some areas, that'll be ideal but 7 is the minimum. Now I know you're sitting there staring at your screen like a little monkey but it's time for you to do something. Rate yourself on the following abilities out of 10, intelligence physical body fighting observation skills leadership mental toughness strategic thinking comment your results and then come back 5 months later after watching this video. First I'll need to be talking about step 0, in order to train like Ayano Koji you need to change your environment and optimize it. The whole point of the white room was to create an optimized environment where children can be nurtured to their fullest potential. But if you look in your room and you got dirty tissues on the ground, a bunch of posters, it's not needed, what you want to do is limit all the dopamine in your vicinity and then leverage it to your advantage. For example, this may be too extreme but in my room I only have my bed, books and my vitamins and take everything else out. This has given me more peace of mind and always makes me go and complete my work since there isn't anything else to do. Next I'll explain how you can optimize your dopamine and use it to not hinder your progress but push it forward. Everyone has a baseline dopamine level which is their default feeling slash mood that they are always in. Individuals with low baseline dopamine levels are typically unmotivated and possibly even depressed, while those with high baseline dopamine levels feel great, accomplish their goals, and are generally more attractive to others. So you're thinking how can I increase my baseline dopamine levels? But it's not as simple as we are now designed to constantly seek dopamine hits from activities that give pleasure, as that can lead to a reduction in your baseline dopamine levels. Vices like scrolling on social media, drinking or drugs and hedonism largely spike your dopamine levels resulting in a lower baseline. To begin immediately lower all these, obviously you can still enjoy yourself but be very conscious. Instead replace these activities with things that increase your baseline dopamine levels, cold showers, sprints, lifting heavy, mediation and good sleep. Once you conquer this, you'll have a higher flow state and easier time completing tasks and living life. Next is diet The White Room's diet was designed to provide optimal nutrition for the students undergoing training. Ayana Koji's diet in the White Room was high in protein, with a focus on lean meats like chicken, turkey, and fish. These meats are low in fat and high in protein, making them an ideal choice for anyone looking to build muscle. In addition to protein, Ayana Koji's diet included foods that were known to increase testosterone levels. Testosterone is a hormone that plays a crucial role in building muscle and burning fat. Foods that are high in zinc, such as oysters, are known to increase testosterone levels. Other testosterone-boosting foods include eggs, spinach, broccoli, and cabbage. Ayana Koji's diet also included foods that were known to boost energy levels and improve cognitive function. These body-boosting foods included nuts, berries, and leafy greens. Nuts, such as almonds and walnuts, are a great source of healthy fats, which can help to improve brain function. Berries, such as blueberries and strawberries, are high in antioxidants, which can help to reduce inflammation and improve cognitive function. Leafy greens, such as spinach and kale, are high in vitamins and minerals that are essential for overall health and well-being. Follow that to the core and your life will change drastically. Next is physical training. 
Ayano Koji training consists of advanced calisthenics 3x per week and heavy lifting 2x times per week. Then he also does martial arts training but here's a workout plan you can follow for this. Day 1, push day push-ups, 4 sets x 15 reps diamond push-ups, 3 sets x 10 reps pike push-ups, 3 sets x 10 reps dips, on parallel bars or chairs 4 sets x 12 reps decline push-ups, 3 sets x 12 reps. Day 2, pull day pull-ups, or assisted pull-ups 4 sets x 8 reps chin-ups, 3 sets x 10 reps inverted rows, using a bar or table 4 sets x 12 reps body weight bicep curls, using a TRX band or similar 3 sets x 12 reps. Day 3, leg and core day pistol squats, or assisted pistol squats 3 sets x 8 reps per leg jump squats, 4 sets x 15 reps hanging leg raises, 4 sets x 12 reps Russian twists, 3 sets x 20 reps, per side, plank, 3 sets x 60 seconds heavy lifting, 2x per week. Day 4, upper body strength bench press, 4 sets x 5 reps deadlift, 3 sets x 5 reps overhead press, 3 sets x 5 reps barbell rows, 3 sets x 8 reps dumbbell curls, 3 sets x 10 reps. Day 5, lower body strength squats, 4 sets x 5 reps Romanian deadlifts, 3 sets x 8 reps lunges, weighted 3 sets x 10 reps per leg calf raises, 4 sets x 15 reps. Lastly let's move on to how he trains his mind to become intellectually superior to all those around him. Firstly, we all know that Ayano Koji reads a lot. So read a large variety of books and don't read them mindlessly but take notes as you'll probably forget them after a couple of weeks. Books like The Brother Karamazov, Liar's Poker, and Laws of Human Nature are a good start. If you guys want a cognitive ability training program let me know in the comments but here's a workout you can do now for your brain. 1. Memory training word list recall, create a list of 20 unrelated words. Read through them and try to memorize as many as you can in 2 minutes. After the time is up, write down as many words as you can remember. Practice this regularly with different words to challenge your recall. The story method, convert a list of items or tasks into a funny or bizarre story in your mind. This can be used for grocery lists, to-do lists, or any other sequence of items. 2. Attention and focus concentration card game, the classic game where you place cards face down and try to find pairs by turning over two cards at a time. The Stroop test, print out or display on a screen the names of colors written in mismatched color ink, example, the word red written in blue ink. Try to say the color of the ink, not the word. 3. Problem solving Sudoku, this classic number puzzle is excellent for logical thinking and pattern recognition. 4. Logical thinking chess or go, these classic board games challenge strategic thinking, planning, and attention. 5. Visual spatial skills jigsaw puzzles, these enhance your ability to identify patterns and visualize spatial arrangements. 6. Language and verbal skills, learn a new language, use apps or courses to start learning the basics. Even if you don't become fluent, the process will engage your brain. 7. Arithmetic skills mental math challenges, Try to solve basic arithmetic problems, addition, subtraction, multiplication, division, in your head. Increase the difficulty as you improve. 8. Creativity free writing, spend 10 minutes writing whatever comes to your mind without editing or censoring yourself. That's all for today's video there's a lot, all the workouts will be in the comments and the description. Thanks for watching and see you guys next time.